All right. Put my glasses on. Pin the Discord link in chat, just in case. But if my bot isn't working still, I need to. Maybe I need to reset the cache and just do everything from scratch. Maybe. But as for now, we'll make sure that. I think I do have stream in DOI enabled this time, but it's probably not going to really be useful. It never really has been. I like to have as much interaction as humanly possible. Because outside of work, I have no social life, so. We're just going to be doing this since I passed out at like 6 p.m. yesterday and woke up at 2 in the morning. Um, it's one of the downsides to only working nine months a year is, well, I have a lot of free time. <laughs> Metal, yes, please. Apparently there's an AI lab for like different songs and whatnot too. I don't know if that's actually useful though. In any case, <coughs> my glasses are on. So I can see and not be a blind piece of crap. <laughs> I think it's blurry without them. Um... You know what, this game, I'm feeling like I want to punch things. And what better way to punch things than five? I don't know why I almost banned Bard. No one plays with this level of play. Let's take care of someone else that's more common. Let's take care of a top player, actually. Um. Darius is used more often than not, right? And no one's playing them, so I can ban them. Actually... I kind of don't want to be Vi, just because we don't have much A we engage, and a move is not going to be the best fit for the composition, so I'm going to bring back old school super tank which would be let me find the proper run page first tank jungle demolish second oh well a moon is also already picked so could go warwick but i could also out tank a Mimu and just be bloody nautilus which i will because why not Substantially better engage in every way. Like, he's got his R, his passive, his W is the only thing that's not CC, so. I also realized that's kind of a joke in itself, not CC. <laughs> um. Most of damage seems to be magical. I'm going to bet Fizz. Twitch will probably be AP, so let's go with them. How does this rune and health scaling? A substantial amount of them have CC, so we're gonna go with unflinching to mitigate the potential problems we'll have with that. And uh, shield bash might be useful in this circumstance, but demolish is still better for cutting down turrets, so we'll go with that instead. Now that I've all, like, got all that sorted, let me join my Discord server and leave it that anyone pops in and uh, decides they want to have a girl. If not, it's there anyways.
Then I need to get last minute holiday shopping done, and I witnessed friends stay at my place for a few days because they're not exactly having the best time with their situation. That's if it's the right thing to do. Feel free to let me know if I need to adjust the music volume. I know it can be loud for some people, so I will adjust it if need be. Um, yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. <clears throat> now, I'm kind of curious. Kill supporting. Like, I know that much for sure. But... In the event she reads late game, that's going to be hell for the enemy team. Because she'll still provide a decent amount of utility with the fact that she can just... Ooh, especially if you get, like, um... The Rider's Grudge, I believe it's called, or Radish Crystal Scepter to Hermo Slow, the enemy team, and then just build like Peer on head after that. Besides, we're already gonna have two relatively bulky people. I say relatively because, unless you know, Shavana builds Peer Tanky, then her only resistance she'll get will be from the dragons we take. But we're still in a very good position to invade level 1. With the exception of the fact that Vayne and Kale don't do much early game damage. I want all stars, and that's something that I would love to utilize if we can. I, ideally, I would want to go for the enemy blue buff to prevent his blue, but I mean, we can do this either way. It's still preventing something. I even got my Q for the purposes of maximizing potential invade damage. Or not invade damage, but you know, pick potential. Alright, um, he should be very close to dead, if not dead. He's dead. Alright. Good job. Two flashes, and we didn't have to do much. Pack up. My last flash is down. Twitch's flash is down, and if he, in, for in fact, he's gonna try to go in. Yeah, he's coming through. He's stopped right now, but I know he's nearby. Alright. Well, I need to secure this and then go grab my buff and then... Ooh! Hey, buddy! Thanks. Thank you. I wouldn't mind giving this to Vayne, but I mean, she's already backing off, so. It's okay. Mm. Alright, now I need to go secure my buffs ASAP. It's a bit of a non traditional pathing, but it does ensure that he can't just tr 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 trade buffs to deal with it. So, that's what we'll be doing. Mm. Not the greatest turnout, but she's should be okay in the long run. Mm. I'd be careful with, with your current position. That can spell disaster, although if you can outlast them, then you're fine. 
I would suggest spending the gold personally, but I mean, that's just me. Um, when they're up, yes. I will do so. They, they kind of need to be spawned for me to do that. You could just get like a pickaxe instead of... Hmm. Well, we're gonna have to hurry this up then. I, looks like we're slightly losing our edge a bit. Maximize potential damage output and damage reduction. I probably going to go with getting a gauntlet. Oh, wait, I can go with this. She's out of mana. We can do this. And Dragon isn't spawned for like another eight seconds. Mimu is too far behind in farm to do much with it. Oh. Well, I mean, she's gone. She's gone. I need to go take care of Dragon then. For some reason, I assumed that uh, Vayne would have gotten BF Sword. It's almost exactly the same cost. I don't have Smite, so there's no point for me to go to Dragon just yet. I don't have it in about it's 16 seconds, so it should be roughly after I finish this and get there that I should be there on time. Okay, now we can do it. So we'll just grab this while I'm at it. More vision, the better after all. Hmm. I don't think she's doing that great on the farm. Yeah, she's not. That's unfortunate. I'm gonna ward this as a precaution in the event that Twitch slash uh, Milo decide to come my way. So far, so good. So they may have backed. Oh no. Mimu. I need to get this within 600. It's gone. We got it. <clears throat> and uh, he also missed his cue, so I'm fine. I'm good to go. Well, I mean... The We're kind of all geared for a late game. With the exception of, like, Cyrus, he's decently good mid and early. So, in the event we make it to late game, which, as low year games tend to last longer, we probably will. I'm gonna actually swing bot once I hit six. Should be after I complete this blue. It is. 
All right. Hmm. There, here's your shutdown. <laughs> and since I'm at still pretty good at HP, I'm gonna take advantage of this and I can counter jungle a bit. Grab this back and start rotating towards my top side jungle. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was terrible. That's okay. It's dead. That delay actually means it. They're overextended again. I could just camp bot lane at this point. Oh, Vayne was in position. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Well, I mean, Twitch has no mana now, so he can't really do much. Do clear my top side jungle and path to drag. I I know it has no bounty. That's not really a concern of mine right now. Dragon's about to spawn. And with their composition they can easily take it within thirty seconds, so I need to get this done ASAP. I'll probably just walk through business since there's no wards there. I can walk around the bush and still unlock it's unlock that they've warded this particular pathway. Hmm. Less than ideal. Should have it by the time I need smite. Yeah, it's about 40 seconds. And with the damage per second I'm doing, it should be okay.
23. I just need to carefully parse this out. Mm, I don't have mana. I may not even need smite at this point. If Mumu was gonna go, was gonna show up, you would have. Get a bit of blobbies and head back bot lane. Mint's currently missing anyways, so there's no reason for me to be there. Oh, well, I mean, he flashed at the moment I R'd, so I guess it's not a downside, other than me wasting R. <sighs> okay, let me clear my bot side jungle and path over to Herald. Which I'll probably just do after I back. Nice work. Most of us see is in the form of slows, with the exception of brands passive being double stacked and a moo moo. So I'll probably still get rough trades and still still a lot of CC. Oftentimes this is a majority of slows and I'll probably end up going like pizza swiftless. But this is not one of those times. Go ahead and do raptors and path over to Herald. Since the Mumu is likely to be headed to bot lane. Oh, well, it looks like Wowie well, took care of herself. That's okay. She's bound to be relatively low HP or low m m mana since there wasn't any sign of a movement assisting in that regard. Let's see. Yes. Um, she's still gonna die though. That's not good. That's okay. He probably has smite. I die don't, so there's not much I can do with this. Oh. I mean, if he's dumb, then sure, I can do this sort of thing. And then we can go deal with them, because I may are. She's already ulted. We could just kill her. Well, we know she's not in there. She backed. Over Colin takes eight seconds. Supposed to leave the tentacles when she ults. I think that's why you've been dying. <sighs> oh well, I need to secure red and then path to dragon. Wait, are we capable of shutting her down here? What size is my items like? Yeah. Ooh, if he dies before I go in, I can't really do anything. No, he's dead. But, okay, I'm gonna just go do my objective. 
Shavana should be able to pick that up. Yeah. All right, let's secure the next turn. Or at the very least, fight them off if they're attempting it right now. Mmm, cool. Yeah, they're hard engaging this. Hmm. Oh well. Should be enough. Let me secure this. Yeah, I don't care about Twitch right now. He's proven he can't do much to stop me if he runs away the second I use any ability on him. He's also t he's also top lane, so there's that too. Might. In this case, I can't do it early because I know that maybe wouldn't be there on time with how much damage we were doing. Now, time to path over to killing Brian slash uh, the rest of them. Maybe. I mean, oh. Well, I'm basically very hard to kill, apparently. Much harder to kill than they initially thought. Let's go deal with these two. My arm's gonna be up at the time I need it. Hmm, that actually might be low enough to get one of them. Ah, that's also my first death. Disappointing. But it's also probably going to end up with two assists. I say probably because it really depends if they re-engage after this. No, they're not going to re-engage. It's a bit risky. Like, well, why you would have to majorly screw up for that to be effective? Um, in this case, they probably, no, maybe is it too high off to make use of it. Uh, uh, optimal course of action would be to retreat in this case. We're going to need either Vayne or them to we screw up for it to be worth it. I mean... <coughs> She's just, well, yeah, we can, I'm here. We can work with this. I mean, I can work with this. She does basically no damage to me, even with tentacles. That's not going to kill me. Like, you're just wasting your abilities at this point. Ooh. Um, I personally would love to go for this. <laughs> oh no. Not with that many. And not with our vein being as low as she is. Why? Back up. I, we're gonna have to no, just walk back to. <laughs> you could just walk back to Bakes. I 
am there. I was going for a flank. <sighs> Vane should have backed. Was... Alright, I'm gonna go heal. Priority of zero is minimizing death, and we're not really doing that that effectively. I had to go heal and purchase items. Brando's not a bot because he hasn't died. And. Well, if it's a if it's a bot, then he would have more deaths than well any of us. So that is definitely not a bot for sure. Um, I need to get frozen heart. Wait. Oh yeah, she does have yelling. Okay, I will need thorn mail then. I'm aware of this, which is why I built as much as armor as I did. Do people not press tab? <laughs> I honestly don't even think I'll be needed for that if Vane's damage output is half. Oh no, she doesn't have mythic completed, so I am going to be needed for this. At least for the smiting portion. That'd be nice. I have a bit of extra damage added to our skill set. I'm not like. Eight. Uh, oh, they, did they surrender or we just win? Oh, they, we just won. <laughs> I'm not really surprised. Like, they kind of ignored Shalana and went for a push. In about two hours, I need to take a quick break to get care of something. Take care of something. I have three bloody messages. Okay.
Oh, that's Warwick. Then I guess I won't be able to be Warwick, will I? Fine. I'll just be a rock. They're all bursty. I'm gonna need bloody fucking this thing. Maybe. We'll see. Actually, no. Most of magic damage so far. So, really magic resist instead of armor. Even though my ability to scale better with armor. Although, this armor does help with clear time, and I can just brush boots let me think here 60% physical 40% magical okay now I can get away with the one armor room um, yeah that's what we'll be going with I'm unlike to be fighting too many people head on early, so I can probably do it without button plating, unless they invade like a bunch. Like, Warwick's likely to invade early on, but not enough to where it'll be a constant need for, for um, button plating. So. Odds are I'll probably have to build um, frozen hearts and let's look at our damage output. A a vessel mask wouldn't be a bad idea, and then provide the damage of my abilities, give me resistances, and make Morgan and Luxo a little bit stronger. Oh look, that's the um Vane from last game. Hey Vin. In this particular circumstance though, since they have a better level one than us, even with if I took like Q or one full AP, then we're not exactly gonna be in the best situation. I would advise we play it safe. Oh, um, I, I wonder if she doesn't even remember me. should specify that so people know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Correct. Um, max my W for. I'm used to paying attention to like everything at once and like 
guess that's where that comes in handy. Alright, let's take a look at the wins here. Risk assessment wise, it looks like we'll probably end up going mid relatively early if they're pushed out. And if not, then I'll just power farm and snowball turn to mirror slash gen respectively. To see oh yeah, he's already ahead in CS, so I definitely need to go bot early on, or top early on to further accentuate that. Assuming she's even still alive, because if not, then I'll probably head bot lane after I back. Warwick's likely going to be trying to get um, Scuttle and then Path to top lane with how first turn the mirror is, so I'm going to need to be ready to counter kink. As I expected, right on schedule. Um, okay, this should prevent her from dying. I want to listen better in the future. I won't always be there to do that. <laughs> oh no. She's. Uh, there's not really any saving you there. You can try and execute. That is your best bet. No one's even remotely near you, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, I got Bramble Vest. I need to rush into my, my mythic now. This was just to mitigate any potential early AD snowballing. And namely, just make Warwick more manageable. Um. I'm gonna actually do this and then path over to check dragon. He's full of keep of soul in it early, easily. I mean I can too, but he's Oh, looks like we're fine. Mm, however the scuttle's still up, so I need to make sure that D spawns before I attempt it. Or pop up the wall and solo it that way. That might be a bit better option. Let's take a look at the CS in top lane. They're still quite ahead. And bot looks to be in a very gankable position. Other than the fact that, oh. Okay. Um, Jin is not doing so good on CS. And just by that alone, Akshan's still ahead in gold. Oryx top side, I can do dragon safely. Ooh. I'm gonna wait until this despawns though. Okay, there we go. The last thing I went is scuttled to give them vision, so I had to wait a sec before I started it. I'd prefer those two don't die, but if they can at least get them low enough to whether or not a threat, that works too. 
My whole thing is just minimizing potential losses. Ooh. Not great. But are they low? Yes. Good. So the odds of, you know, one of them coming in my direction is not going to be very high. And I think I should still be okay. Only problem is that I don't have smite currently. A uh, few seconds. Uh, looks like we're fine. Eh, you took it from me, you jerk. Oh, that's okay. I'll just walk away. I even had Q if Morgana didn't show up, so I could have just stolen his move speed. I was gonna say, if you have another Q, you could just kill him. Or, I mean, I could kill him. <laughs> One of us could kill him. I mean... I didn't know you accept my Q to out damage your auto attack. I know you're in the middle of reloading, but we don't. The last thing we wanted is him to get away. I'm gonna clear this and. I'm not in a position where I can stop him right now, but War Turn to America can easily kill him. And Riven's not really in a position where she's going to contribute a lot to a fight. Like, she'll do some, but not much. <laughs> As I said, not much. <laughs> that early CS lead kind of made him much easier to handle things. I don't think they need me for that. Let me check their damage output. Nico's on the way, so I may as well just be there for insurance purposes. Oh, yeah, that is a problem. That's okay. I believe I can get there in time to at least make sure that Lux doesn't get dived. Because I know Trinomir's dead. She's fine. They don't seem to be pursuing her. Um, right, we're turning shot off now. I wasn't even remotely close to you there. Oh, well, I mistimed that. That's okay. I need it back. I have items to buy. <laughs> Alright, I desperately need to get my jock shows now and boots. Rectroid still might be a decent option. Yeah, it's still a decent option. They have a lot of hard to see. Does he have red buff? He does not. I can take his red buff. Could probably also dive driven with her current health like and items. Oh yeah, we definitely can. Alright, so dive driven and then take enemy red buff and back and prep for drag. Uh 
Um, you should still be fine. You got undying range ticking, right? Yeah. Okay. Next dragon is Ocean. That'd be a really good for uh, me specifically since it heals based on max HP. By the time I get there, my spot will be up. Ooh. How's Tway looking? Pretty low health. Alright. Um, we may have a chance to cut them off before we do Dragon. Dragon hasn't been started yet by the enemy team either, so... Let's take care of this first to minimize potential threats. And then we just do this. And I'll probably just swing mid in our way because he's most likely relatively low health. Oh no, he's full. Okay. Um, that's not the real Nico. The, the real one actually got out of range. I don't know why that is being pursued that often, Lux. You may want to not do that. That would be why. I'm dead. Uh, full health and have like almost two in an armor. I can survive this shit easily. Quite easily in fact. Alright, let's get rid of red. No major team. The Tony Bear is gonna die. They're all pursuing him. Need to back and get a portion of my boots and Jack Show. Preparedles. Okay, um, even if uh, Warwick doesn't get killed immediately, we can just do Herald after he dies, since three of them are dead and we'll have a minimum of one casualty. Why are you taking blue? You don't need blue, Trindamir. You don't even use energy. Silly. Works dead, so the potential risk, while I don't have smite, isn't high, but it's still possible. Um, I have fault. Alright, that's enough for that. I'm probably dead. Hopefully not. Uh, I died to like a second Nico Q. But my gun is at decently high SP, she might be able to save them off. Let's see. Um yeah. They're kind of overextending a bit. And I actually no, a lot. <laughs> Alright, well, 
Let's take a look at the most damaged lanes. It, no, none of the turrets have really been touched, except for, to some extent, top lane. Let's fix that. Warwick's pushing bot alone. We can get rid of him. If he's dumb enough to go for you, you can just CC him to hell. I get my Q, but the other, okay, he ulted. That's fine. I didn't mean to ping that, I meant to ping his R. You're still dead, buddy. Actually, while I'm here doing this, I'm gonna just drop heralds. <sighs> we got time to secure the dragon. And the turret at the same time. Let's go. Um, about 20 seconds or so we need to go. Alright, let's go get this done. If we can just get him low enough to where he's not a threat, that's all we really need to do. Second one's Nico, first one's Rick. I only have one charge of smite, so I gotta be careful with this. Okay, let's go deal with Zakshan. I have my R. He also took a turret shot for free, so. Hmm, he's likely to get away actually, his uh, grappling hook will be off cooldown. All right. I need that farm more than you do, buddy. Oh well. Ooh. He's dead. Or, wait, no. He might actually kill her before he dies. No, he's dead. I mean, maybe not in that particular instance, but he is dead. I have a lot of resistances, and I don't really think you should be trying to fight me, Nico. Can you survive for two seconds? Yep. <sighs> I have thrown mail, dude. You're not gonna survive this. Even if we've Lux did an ultimate.
Oh. I've been pretty lackluster on the boards here. I've just been on the ball with jungle timers. <laughs> Alright, let's um, aim to drop someone and then go for Baron. We can forgo one dragon if it means that we get Baron. So you're about to have like five people converge on you. There's no reason why they wouldn't. If you're two people alone like that. And squish your targets at that. Let's uh, aim to secure mid slash top turd as a group. Okay, that should be enough for me to at least save their asses, and it is enough for me to- Hello! Goodbye. Do not, I'm the last person you should be trying to fight. Especially with my items. Just some spawning in a matter of seconds. Warwick's dead, he's most likely to pursue mid lane. We can do it safely. Hmm. Only problem is if they had my direction before Jin's able to wait a minute. Okay. They do have knowledge of where he is, but not where I am. I can actually work with this. Yeah, because I have And if Warwick's ignoring it, that means they haven't actually started it yet. Okay, let's kill Warwick and make sure that we secure it. Good. I was kind of waiting on that. Alright. Okay, I need to back and deal with Zakran. He's just taking over here, better. Warwick's top side, so it's relatively risk free. Two of them are top side, so we'll have a max of three people here. Secured. Yep. Hmm. Oh, yes. I got feared there, so there's only so much I can do. Are you still alive? Yeah, alright. 
Ah, uh, damn it, Akshan. He's got that, unfortunately. We need to make sure we kill him before anything else. He's the only one pushing. Hmm. That's okay. I have items to buy. We really gotta push. Uh, he can probably kill Warwick. I'm gonna Nico kill some first. Oh no, he'll be fine. No, no bueno. No bueno. All the bueno. You've been on thorn my side. Please do. Please attack me. I, I'm the last person you should be trying to hit. This is the only person you're gonna be allowed to hit. Um, all right, we need a war baron and regroup. Make sure I grab this. And blue buff since I'm relatively mana hungry. Alright, I need some magic resist now. Let's see him for force of nature actually. And I guess finish off with abyssal. We should be pushing bot lane if they're all zeroing on that lane. We gotta do something. <laughs> My guess is about, about 15 seconds before at least two people show up to kill Trinity Bear. Hmm, as luck would have it. Two people to show up to kill Trinity Bear. That's not ribbon. I don't think it's ribbon. If we could drop him, that'd like be better than anyone else right now. Can we? It's gonna be dumb and pursue the oh, okay. Akshan. He's out of position. He's gone. Um, I'll do. I'll make a point of war this in case they try and sneak it. Oh, uh, with him being in that close in proximity, they're, they're prepping for Baron. Um, if they can get in range of him to kill him, like that'd be ideal, but I don't see that happening. Enemy team is coming to counteract their pushing. Um, 
Raven is alone. I just need to confirm that before I even go in. Okay, yeah, we can do Dr Dragon safely now. Warwick's topside. I don't care about Riven. I really don't care about Riven. <laughs> She's gonna be devoting all her effort to stopping that mess. And we got this in the back. That's fine. Acceptable losses. Okay, we need to maximize potential use of this, so I'm back. Alright, well I'm dealing with Elder. That didn't turn out as expected. Can she just kill him? She can. Quite easy, in fact. Alright. If you can drop him, and we can make sure that Huey isn't near us, we can do Baron. But this is... We do need to make sure we get that inhibitor. Can we rush it actually? Yeah. Oh yeah. No, he's too out of range. C continue normal operations. They don't have my exact whereabouts in mind, so that's why I'm here. Pressing. Okay, if we're all it's made, then we're fine shoving this. Mm. Oh, you didn't use raw. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, I'm okay with that. I was still known with the elder, so that's all we needed. <sighs> Warwick's alive, he can zero in on you and kill you. That is what I was concerned about. Let's go with an abyssal mask.
Alright. Riven's dead. We can effectively push this and then utilize Baron if need be. Wait. Alright. That's Baron. Two of them are dead. Risk is minimal. All right. Well, if we're not doing that, then I need to make sure I get vision on it. We still can. Two of them are dead. I would recommend we do so. But I need more than myself. I am not a damage output. All right. I'm starting. It looks like people are on the way. I didn't even need, need to smite that. Shouldn't we have just critted it to death? That's kind of funny. Alright. Push bot on top. Or, or, yeah, we need to. Trinibur can go bot. He has hole breaker. Rest of it should be mid. Elder's not as important as making sure that we have pressure. Guys. Alright, you better be able to do that fast, because we need to make sure we utilize as much of Baron as we possibly can. She's dead. I don't care about this. I have so much resistance as it doesn't matter right now. I don't even remember that. Who did I report? I don't think I reported them like today, so it must have been like from a day or two ago. Um, Shinmir was kind of being a jerk. So, I believe it would fall under at least negative attitude. Moving on. In approximately two hours, I need to take a break to get tears. Take care of some things in the morning.
Let's get rid of this. Substantial amount of our damage is AoE, so let's get some single target to balance it out. from did, did someone say something in chat before uh, I, the game started I'm not entirely sure but not exactly too important either hmm. I may want to go mid lane early on but we'll see Oh, hi there. I didn't realize someone was going to pop in. Usually people don't. How's it going? Uh, it's okay if you don't have a mic. Just make an emote or something if you can hear me. I'm guessing you're the Navia, just based on what I've seen, so. Alright. That should make you ganking bot lane a little bit easier because you're the main person with hard CC. <sighs> I won't need a wish, it's just more helpful if I have one, but it's not required either way. In that case, since. Oh, you left. Oh. Oh. Wow. Well. We may have lost our... Midliner. And now they're back. I wouldn't really worry too much about the need for an Oracle Lens early on. Also, they won't be warding super early. It says Remake enabled, but like, he's here. We have 30 seconds. Um, Alright, he's here. I mean, he is going to land right now, but people have voted yes anyways, so. Well. I don't mind playing next game. 
Or if you don't want to, that's fine too. I do to party and feel free to accept it if you want. If not, then see you around. I didn't hit Q up by the way, so let me fix that. Um, I don't think I added you properly. Well, in that case, I'm gonna go back and add you directly. Either that or you declined, because it didn't even say you were invited in the first place. So I will make sure I use friend, and then if you wanna join, you can. If not, that's fine. Alrighty. Round two. Uh, I'm just gonna be. Oh, as far as bans go, I don't like really care who you ban. Like bans don't really matter to this level of play. If someone doesn't know what they're doing, they usually can't use counters effectively. So you can ban whoever you want, for all I know. Okay, um, looks like we're dealing with a Briar. She's weaker against tankier champions. So I will be good old MMO. That's going to provide a lot of AoE, a decent amount of engage, given that we have three forms of AoE already. And a decent follow up to your CC. So it's a win win all around. I need to switch my room page though. Majority of their damage is physical. I can get away with two armor runes. They're all physical except for um, Cassidy, so. Should be an easy b 
bulk up and we'll be okay. I mean, ideally you want to get like both. Plus if you build um, not righteous glory. The other item. Uh, Radiant Virtue, that'll, that'll give you a substantial amount of cooldown reduction. But you could go, um, what's the item called? Wretch of Rallyas for Ability Haste. I, on the other hand, am probably going to rush right into, um, Jack shows and then get a uh, demonic embrace later on. I wait. Huh. How's your level one compared to ours? Okay, yeah, we can make a use of that. Their level one is kind of garbage, with the exception of like Garen. That's kind of it. Ooh, okay. Um, might be a problem. Re-engage on Garen. Okay, two flashes down, we didn't have to really do anything. I'm okay with that. We don't need to go for the buff, we just burned abilities. I don't need to. So that's kind of a redundant statement. <laughs> Actually, this would be cheaper. do here do keep in mind although the odds of this like consistently happening isn't high but you can use your R to get out of Tom's W if you if he tries to eat you since it does remove all CC Also, come to think of it, every single time it's tried to eat MF or you, you can just hide them away. Uh, I'm taking a break from doing Krugs to intercept that. I don't think she's going to keep trying to pursue, but she might. Alright, I'll just do Krugs and hang here just in case. There's a possible chance she might try to go do try and gank bot lane. Either that or she'll be going top. Actually, with how Vagar's position, she'll most likely be going top. He positioned more towards the bottom side of his wing, so... I'm coming. There's a chance he may be here to try and follow up, so I'm gonna be here to exploit that. <clears throat> we 
Let's get Tom or at least someone. We gotta make sure we utilize whatever gold we can get. Good job. If my guess is correct, she did in fact take Skittle, and by the cooldown it currently has, it was relatively recently. Alright, Briar's bottling, so I can get Wolves and actually just Path to Dragon. Or top one, I mean. Yeah, I'm gonna get Wolves and then take um, Raptors and then just do, dra do Dragon if she's gonna waste her time up there. Uh, I'm not in a position where I can get there in time. I think you'll be okay though. Since this just despawned, I can do this safely. Oh, might be a problem. Less concerned about her attacking me and more concerned about losing the dragon. I lost the dragon. <sighs> Although, they did burn a lot of their cooldowns, so you may be able to just kill them all now. Most of them, anyways. Eh, that's some. Uh, I'm gonna do Krugs. We can probably just re engage if you can survive that long. Already gonna be on the way there. Q, auto. Alright. I'm coming. I don't know if it'll do my- oh no, he's very out of position. I need him to try and go for one of you, because then Jimav can get a kill. Oh, gee, he left. It's okay. Um, she may actually back and spend her gold. She's got a bounty and geez, I'm out of it. No reason not to utilize the gold you have. Ready soon. There it is. That's top. Oh, top is actually dumpstering him. Okay, I need to snowball Trinity more than he already has. Figure's doing semi decent as well, but. Kessin's gonna be hard to catch post six unless he runs low on mana. Or just like horribly at horribly out of position. So Based on what items Jinx has and what items the map has, you guys can win a fight. Jinx only has boots and orange and MF. Has a decent amount of matter with already going. If you get them low enough to where. I mean. Okay, if they are going over there, I'm gonna just do Herald and use the top line.
The odds of Brian here being here anytime soon is not going to be high. She was just bot lane, so unless she backs and hits right over, we're fine. Oh, actually, yes. All the yes. Um, I can just kill him. F my R. Ooh, Briar. I did all of them both, so maybe he can make use of that and kill one of them, if not both. He'll get Briar at least. Maybe he'll get both. But now he's definitely getting both. <laughs> cool. That worked out. And probably even first hurt. Yep. Alright. That was a net gain all around, only with the cost of me dying. Yeah, I'm already headed over. Briar's top side, so we really don't run the risk of that being a problem. Let me just take her blue while I... Oh, no. It's spotting in a matter of seconds. It's also a hex tech, so. Or, no, it's cloud. My apologies. The move speed will be useful for us because we're not exactly a super fast team. We are engaged and blow them up team, so. That'll be useful for that. Hmm. Can we actually get there to save Vagar in time? Yes. I don't even think I need to though. He's fine. It's also got his mythic already, so that's good. Cassidy doesn't have enough for his yet, so we don't run the risk of that being an issue. I have noticed Cassidy tends to run bot more than he does in the other lane, so just keep an eye out for that. I may actually head there soon. Let's look at their health. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely going to head bot after Crux. I have my ultimate. Put it over. Odds are they don't have that bush boarded because. Okay, if you can keep them from recalling, or to, at the very least one of them. I just need them to be. Yep. That should still be death, or at the very least, most of the turret damage. There. Um, I'm pretty sure that they are can kill Cassidy. I'm more concerned about both of them killing him before he does it. Not quite. But we are getting turret down, and that's what matters. He's probably going to try and use um, Last Cone. Alright. <clears throat> he's, he's my direction. Oh no, he's gone. He looped back around. 
and still died to whatever it was. I need to back and get my mythic. I'll be prepped for team fight after that. Wait, no, I don't need this. I need this. Only one person has teleport, so that's Cassidy and Botman. There's a high chance enough we'll die before we can get there. I thought so. He's got a decent amount of items and a bounty, so I'm not in a position where I can simple we CC him he's designed to isolate targets and kill them individually oh, why would I need armor pen he has no armor Oh dear, okay. They're all conversion on me. I'm probably gonna die here. I do say probably, because the odds of me surviving are possible, but not high. Um, I guess that's fine, because Chenbeer can just... Uh, I honestly feel like it'd be better off for him to finish Herald, but I mean... You might not just do that. They're gonna be focusing on dragons, so it's a decent trade. It'll also allow you to take top inhibitor. So there's that too. Because what they have in the ability to kill us, they lack in the ability to utilize that potential gold. You, you can take an educated guess in R, but the odds of you really getting there in time to steal it is not going to be very high. If you're going to do it, you do it now. Well, I'm sad. Maybe not. Maybe not. No. Definitely not. Oh, with how low we're getting, and we could probably re-engage once I heal. <sighs> he has Herald, yes? Oh, no, he already used it. Didn't. Like, just use it. That's okay. He nearly got the inhibitor for that. That's why I'm getting magic resistance. I knew it would be a problem eventually, but not early on. They're also not pushing, so we have that work for us. Oh. We're gonna use force of nature in his case. Take get a control while I'm at it. Magic resist from base probably won't be too warranted because they are still majority physical damage. 
But I mean, you, you already have them bought, so. Oh, um, actually. Okay. He is currently in a position where we can kill him. I just need to catch him with some form of CC, and he'll die. I kind of wanted to try and recall with the turret, because uh, my phones are all, you have yours, I have mine. <coughs> Good. Um... That's uh, fine. He burned enough cooldowns where you can probably get away safely. He's... I say probably because if he goes on a map app, you just headbutt him. Good job. Like all his killing us doesn't matter if he doesn't push. It still helps him, but if he doesn't utilize it, you know, so. I'll do full clear and a uh, ward baron. They're likely going to be trying to attempt that soon to offset the fact they're not pushing. Oh, you already got the ward down there. Okay, we're good. I would recommend we try and kill Kassadin first, because while well, he can kill us. Oh, if he's botling, then we can just do it. Alright, well, if we're going to be doing Baron this early, we do it now. Because casting is all the way at bot. I'm okay with forgoing one dragon if it means we get the Baron this early to shove even further. Let's go. Yeah, cast is bot. He's the only damage I'll put. They also don't have this warded, so this is right under their nose. By the time they do get here, we'll have already gotten it. Cassidy is pushing bot. I can hold him off. You sh can shove mid and t t top, respectively. I have enough magic to survive for a little bit. Can't necessarily kill him, but I can be annoying. Uh, to be honest, I don't really need to. I just need to make sure that he doesn't back. He's gonna try and recall soon. I mean, I'm fine with that. We're about to like m mow down their nexus. Alfred. He's still not backing. All right, do you have about eight seconds to leave recalls? You should probably get out of there now. He's he's already backed. Good. The best mask is useful because it amplifies Vagar's damage and my own, and yours to some extent, and the damage of um, Sunfire.
Briar isn't there quite yet, so we may have a chance to contest this. Not as much as I was hoping. But I mean, preventing them from doing dragon or backing makes that makes sure our minions can push. So honestly, we can just stop them from recalling to let the minions do their work. Yeah, this is fine. Casting is the only one defending, so. You can just do dragon after this because she's really the only one that can kill any of you. And if you just teleport spot, then he leaves mid lane completely open, so it's a win win either way. Like, he either stops you or stops Trinmere from ending the game. In both those scenarios, he's gonna lose something, so. Just let Kassin do his thing and keep him from backing. Simple. Good job. That right there is testament that you can have all the kills in the world but if you don't push then your kills are effectively going to be null and void because you don't utilize the advantage in any case I'm going to be playing to so Q, but it was a nice fun game for you Oh crap, I didn't bend someone. Oh, shit. Would be a good idea to dodge that one, even if it was unintentional.
fuck is this person? I don't know you. Mm. I really don't know who this is. Check my work email. Ah, oh, I'm not doing notifications actually. Two minutes and three seconds. All right.
Hmm. Get rid of her briar. I'm going to actually switch with the music. Is there a classical section? There is not. So, fine. I, let's see what this deep deep chill playlist is. Actually, run this one yet. Hmm. My sheets. I'm. What is. What are. Oh, I misread that. One, I tend to. I'm a bit of a rest sleeper. So when I sleep, my fitted sheets tend to just be torn off the bed when I sleep because I move a lot when I sleep. So after a while, I just stopped caring, and that's where they are. They are currently kind of like not on the bed at all because I ripped them off when I was asleep. Yeah. Um. With how much I move during me being asleep, that doesn't really play a factor. So, I've had a heavier weighted sheets and I've just still torn them off just fine. <laughs> Plus, like, I, I'm the type of person where I can sleep on anything, so sleeping on a bed without fitted sheets doesn't really matter. If I'm tired enough, I'll just pass out. Hmm. Oh, I've played with that gin before. Quite recently, in fact. That was... The same one that was with the Alistair I played with, I believe. But Alistair isn't in this game. So, if his playstyle is consistent, I believe I can get away with ganking him early. But we'll see how that works out. <sighs> Plus, due to the fact that Yumi will probably be attached to Jin most of the time, that makes it so I'll need to aim at one target. Okay, yeah, I may be about level 3 just based on the fact that there's a lot of poke and decent hard CC, so. We'll see how that plays out though. I mean, you need to have it at level 4 instead of level 3. Actually, if I had it at level 4 and the, the gank is successful, that means I can dragon early on. I mean, I can, I can dragon even if I don't do it, but it just makes it easier. Mm. 
I may just um, start red and then path to bot lane and then gank that and depending on the result of that do dragon either with or without the ally bot lane so you do can get to lane I'm not really worried about it if I lose blue it's not as pertinent as me losing red buff Actually, based on the fact they're probably going to be wishing for the enemy, you may be able to cut them off and try brush and burn someone's flash. But we'll see how that works in practice. Dead body in top lane. Yeah, by the simple fact that the enemy bot lane is not pushed, it's probably a better idea that I went to go to start red. I'd be careful. I believe William might be trying to be there early. If anything, it would offset the fact that Riven's behind. It's low. I don't have any bloodhound from him, so no, he's not. Could probably at least screw him away from minions though before I go about my business. He's already back in. I'll be maximizing W for to utilize the fact I have Sir Audi. So, um, hello is. Bot line, not too terribly low. If you can get them to push out a bit, I'll be there shortly. Hmm. Is this blood hunt from mid? No, it's not. He's definitely from bot. He's gonna try and prevent someone from recalling, but it looks like you're fine. Hmm. Let's. Okay. Well, just top lane and Riven's relatively low. That means I can do dragon safely. I I can see that. <laughs> I am probably gonna make a point to make the bot lane no longer a threat first. So let's uh, at least try and force them out. Hmm. Okay, that should give them all enough so they're not a problem, and they've burned a lot of their mana and cooldowns. We can do this safely.
I can solo it. It's just faster with people. You could just... The blast cone is over there if you're trying to use that, so... No one's gonna take it. We're fine. <laughs> Well, yeah, I would have showed up long before then if she was gonna. Yeah, let's get rid of Yasu. Oh, uh, no, he already knew we were coming. Okay. Well, I have jungle camps to clear. You worded that side specifically, so if I go around, we should be fine. Or like through the lane, that'll work too. Y y Yasu's most likely to be passing towards bot, if not Woya herself, so just to warn you. Riven's gonna kill him. Good news is she'll be too bad actually to do anything doing wise. She's gone. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not, I don't have the red buff to actually kill her there. That wasn't really much of a fight. <laughs> so no, it wasn't. But... Can counter jump a bit. I need to back after this. We're not going to really have much in the way of engage, or like, sustained engage, so getting some resistances wouldn't be a bad idea, because then I can just build on hit after that. I kind of want to get this first, just to amplify my potential damage output. You don't need my help taking blue. You can just take the blue. Or is she low? Why is she even pushing if she's that low? She's gonna cut through here. And her. <laughs> All right. Now we can get rid of Willia and then secure her felt. Oh, well. that's fine. We can still secure Rift Herald. We just need to make sure she's not part of the fight. Should see load actually want to do anything, then we're fine. Oh, this is risky. Please tell me you can keep him busy for a few more seconds. I don't think you can. Well, I'm already engaged on this. I'm not. I either attempt to secure it or. I and die or I don't die anyways. 
I don't know why that was chosen as a course of action. We didn't need to dive them there. The main goal was obtaining the Rift Herald, but that's okay. Mistakes happen. I'll secure the next dragon myself. Cap tech is very useful. Damage resistance, heat, and healing. If it's Yasu, I have my ultimate. I'm not really too concerned about him. And when ball doesn't block a flying wolf in your face. Alright, let's go deal with these two. Jin's already used his ultimate, so the potential for his damage off is going to be severely hindered. No? Malphite almost has Zar. You could probably work, make use of this if he gets in position. Oh, darn it. Oh, that's unfortunate. So if I was building tanky, I had a feeling that would be a problem. Yeah, I'm gonna get um round reds only early. All all the damage is physical with the exception of Jimmy and well yeah, so Jimmy's not really gonna be a primary damage source though. I need a power farm. I'll deal with Botland a bit later. One, I need my Mythic, and two, I, I need to make sure that I can get my ability to get my R off. I always build my mythic first since everything else I buy is that much better with it. There's like a few exceptions, but I mean, uh, that's not really my main concern at the moment. We need to make sure we don't push or don't get them, let them push. I don't believe that it hit. It did not. Oh, you finished her off anyways. That works. Yeah. This is why I wasn't going to the blue side because that's not really the main concern at the moment. Also, she's capable of killing me currently. I was just a waste of my smite. Good news is she probably won't go to my red. She's gonna be pursuing top line. There we go. And we're getting a turret too. I think. Yeah, she's got it. 
Um, no, she's gonna. Uh, she's incredibly fucking greedy. I don't really see this. Oh well. I'm dead. I should have let Jinx die, honestly. I need to play more s selfishly. <laughs> <sighs> Damned altruism. Yeah, I'm just not gonna play with that in mind. Once I get red and zoning though, I'll be fine. It's really good at reducing critical hit damage. Malphite almost has the power. Vagar is gonna have his by the time Malphite has his. They can nuke him and pretty damn effectively too. Oh. Jin is probably a bait. Y'all see he's floating around here. Which actually means I can just secure Rift Herald if they're gonna be doing this. Yeah, that's fine. Just go for Rift Herald. They get one dragon, we get Rift Herald, which will net us at least two turrets, if not one and a half. That's fine. Like, there's nothing we can do to contest that dragon right now. But we can secure Rift Herald with relatively no risk. And we just pop it whatever lane they're not going. They're probably going to be Season Man, so... Use it bottom top. Y y is gonna be headed your way shortly, but you should be able to get the turret at least. Yeah, you're fine. Just keep pushing. That's all that matters. Cause at the end of the day, you secure objectives, that's what's gonna win. Yas is not pushing and that's gonna be his downfall. Uh we don't have much time to push this. But we need to wave. Apologies, Vagar, but a simple risk assessment. If I went into going with you, I would, I would also die, so. If I alt him and you put your traps behind him, we should be able to kill him. But that's assuming it's just him. It might not be. Okay. Well, we have top lane or er, bot lane, so we do have eyes on her. I can clear a bit of my jungle safely. I'm not really con okay. So yeah, if you want to get fed, just target re re revenge if no one else like importance around, because she's the person with the least potential to survive. So. If you're not in a position where you can kill like Yasu or Jin, then just go for Raven. Ooh. That's that's actually really good. The fact he burned it and you didn't really need to use it all means you're fine. Um Ooh, yes, 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 yes. Go, go, go. Play it safe, because you're still in a position where you can be burst by Yasu if he catches you out of position. Okay, he's top lane, so we're just going to get rid of her, and then I'll whoop around to help deal with Jin. Jin's alone, Yasu's top lane. This is our chance to shut him down. Hmm, no. I need to have Vagar with me, and he's just not here. I have damage reduction. We're fine.
you're still there. So, only problem is we don't know where Yasu is. So, we either do this like really fast or it's not gonna work because Yasu will follow up right afterward. Um, okay, yeah, go. We drop him now or it doesn't work. Um, Yasu, she's gonna come in from the side, other side. Our mistake there was all ulting in the Vagar cage. We should have ulted behind it because he was going to try to flash out of it. But I mean, that's something we can still get wise in the future. There we go. One down. And that's not even the main threat, but it's still some gold. But, generally speaking, if you want gold, Jinx, or anyone, just kill Riven, if you're not able to get CS. She's going to be a guaranteed gold pot. And actually, Yasu's top lane, Jin's out of position. She still has a 150 gold bounty. We can end him. He's dead. And that means that we can probably kill Yasu too, because Jin and Yasu were the main damage threats. I'll go with Vagar to hold them off, you two can take Dragon. I don't think he's going to keep pushing though, so. He's gone. He's taking um, Krugs and then waving. He's not going to just sit there. Oh, I stand corrected. I could have sworn he would have just left out of that. All right, I'll be up there shortly. Although I think in... Watch, as I say this, now he actually backs. Oh, stay, he's that for me. Okay. That's fine. I have more than enough moves speed to get away from him. He's going to be bot lane in a matter of 25 seconds, if he recalls. But it looks like he's focusing on siege and mid, so you have a brief m moment of opportunity. Uh, he's headed over there. You need to leave. Jasu is going to be there in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Huh. Weird, I would have sworn he would have shown up by now. And unless he backed and he was walking over there. That'd make more sense if because I would thought he would have just gone there straight from mid lane. Um Yeah. I guess he took a while to buy items and then, then the death way took some time. But since oh no. Riven's not really a problem, but the problem is that we're going to have like four people on our butt soon. I don't like this. The fact that we don't know where Yasu is means he could be trying to flank us right now. I mean, I tried to ult him, but that would have been ideal there. Well, the good news is, if I did him out, we can kill him. If being the keyword. I need to get random with someone. I have more than enough resistances to, to deal with him. We just need to make sure. No, we definitely win that. I, I have plenty of resistances. We get three people to focus him. Myself, Vagar, and Jinx, and he dies. Because I just alt him and he can't do anything. It's really not going to be hard to kill him. We just got to make sure we use our CC properly.
Hmm. I don't feel. Yeah, he, she's. Y'all sees it's heading my direction, so you're fine mid lane briefly. He's gonna try and dive, so we need to prep for that. If not, he'll be rotating in mid lane. Oh, if we can catch him out here, this might be a good. No. We, we need to time this perfectly for it to work. He's dead. Should be anyways. No? No? Okay. Well, actually... If only Jinx and you Malphite had their ultimate, that would have been perfect. But it's okay. We can hold them off and Jinx can push. Oh. Okay, well, the fact you can even do that to Jin alone is kind of all we need to just make sure they can't siege, so. Ooh. Okay, I need to leave. I was just trying to prevent him from backing more damage Jinx can get off and I didn't really die anything so it's fine I'm not killing you is not the goal I just need to make sure you don't back so Jinx can push <laughs> yeah random with um uh, is really good for critical damage reduction I've altered um, we can kill him, we're just not focusing, and if that's not what we're, we're not going to be doing, then I'll just do other things. <laughs> like, we're either all on the same page, or it doesn't work. And it doesn't seem like we're on the same page, so I'm not going to be bothering trying to kill y'all soon anymore. But yeah, if anyone wants gold, just kill Riven. Like, she's not worth a lot of gold, but she's worth enough to. Oh no. Okay. You need to not beat her at all. If we can stop Yasu from recalling, you'll see when he's even still here, though. They're probably going for set. Alright, I'm gonna shove bot lane. It's pretty clear they. Yeah, I'm going bot lane. You two may want to play it safe. No, I told you the, what we can do to kill him, and no one wants to do so, so if that's not happening, then we're just not going to kill him. Simple. Uh, I need to... He's, oh, he's low. Okay. Do I have like two seconds to get blue? I do not. And she's probably got enough voice to be at full health again. So, yeah, no. We need to all focus him together or he won't die because I have enough damage reduction to survive long enough for people to do damage. 
he is going to try to do burn. It will not be successful if we time this correctly. I, I'm aware that we may have to let them take this. But, I know I can at least get vision on it. Um, actually, that's probably okay, because it sets out a push, and you can delay the recall just a little bit. That's fine. Um, honestly, that's kind of all it is. We just need to just prevent them from backing. You likely have time to grab that and leave. Maybe the inhibitor, and that's assuming they don't, like, kill you immediately. I guess they don't really want to kill you immediately. <laughs> Okay, that's nice. Oh, looks like I'm the only one building the damage reduction. I'm doing okay. Yourself? Uh, if we're not able to properly coordinate, I don't really see that dragon happening. It's going okay. It's critical damage reduction by a lot, and it always damages critical head base. If no one's gonna buy it except for me, then I guess there's no point in me buying it. <sighs> no, I do not want to, so. No, that's not gonna be happening. Okay, if you know, then why not buy it? No, not a waste of time. We're not able to get in range. The fuck did I get hit by? Oh no. Ow. Painful. Oh well. I need to get some magic resist. Probably need a spirit visitors game since fights seem to last a bit, little bit longer than I want them to.
about to die, dude. It did, actually. I survived longer than, mo than most people, but that's okay. You're free to believe whatever you want. You're also free to be banned, but I mean, that's we already know that's gonna happen. Anyways, I have errands to go run. Oh, I got all 